guys, Mary Elizabeth here. Welcome or welcome back. Today's video is sponsored by Hallmark Signature and I am doing a really fun kind of horseshoe room decor. It's really cool to hang on the wall. It's perfect for a present. It's perfect for a man, for a woman, for a child, for an older person. Seriously, this can work for anyone if you do it right. I found these horseshoes actually, I've seen them around in different boutiques and they are expensive. I actually opted to get draft size horseshoes which a draft horse is just a huge giant horse. I mean, some of y'all know that, like a Clydesdale. I thought it was kind of cool to get a bigger horseshoe for decor purposes, but literally you could probably Google and find any kind of size, anything you want. I went for the simplest thing. And to me, horseshoes, I mean, I shouldn't say to me they represent good luck. Horseshoes represent good luck. I made mine for my friend Brooke, who is one of my favorite people in the whole wide world. She lives in Austin, Texas, and I go and visit her fairly often. She comes out here, and I met her, gosh, years ago, and literally she was walking out. We kind of worked together during Fashion Week, for LA Fashion Week, and it was over, and she was leaving, getting her stuff, and for some reason, do not ask me why, but I am so grateful I did. I sort of was like, felt a little sad about this girl leaving, and I ran after her, and I said, I feel like I should give you like a hug or something. And she was so nice and goes, okay, give me a hug. And then she goes, well, we get to hang out. Like, give me your phone number. And she's really good at that and she has a lot of friends and that's why. And we basically became best friends. We've driven across the country together, like kind of the long way through Marfa, Texas to Austin and then up to New Orleans for her birthday. And she's just such a dear friend to me. Like she is, somebody that I can call, I can text anytime. I just feel like I've gone through so much and she's one of those people that loves you for who you are and for your flaws and just kind of accepts you. And it's not about doing the right thing or being the right way. And also, she just makes me laugh. Like, you know there's certain people you can like talk to. I mean, literally we were texting last night, literally texting and I'm like cry laughing. Okay, like cry laughing from texting. Actually, I think it was like Instagram personal message, direct messaging. She reminds me basically to not be so hard on myself and that it's all good. And we can just be each other's support system in that way. And I'm just so grateful. And I'm so grateful for Brooke. She's literally just like my favorite person in the world. So I wanted to make her like a really special present and share it with you guys. Cause hopefully it's something that you would want to make too. It was really important to me to have a really special card and a really special present because I'm mailing them. So I wanted it to be something that literally shares how I feel and that just kind of portrays that in a really special way. I was looking at all the different cards I could choose from and they did all these really cool collabs with different people. And I didn't really realize who I was going to choose. And of course I find the perfect card that matches my little horseshoe that I love so much and actually is a little ornament, a detachable ornament, which is pretty cute. And it is by the house that Lars built, who I follow on Instagram. And it's not a big surprise. I adore her style. I think she is so fabulous. It's so funny when you pick something like that. And it's weird how Instagram is. I don't know, maybe you guys feel like this is about YouTube too. You feel like you know people. So I don't necessarily feel like I know her, but all of a sudden I feel a little ownership of it. Like, oh, it's my girl, because I follow her on Instagram. So it's really exciting. So I feel like I get to share this really special thing with Brooke and this really special present that I made and mail them off for Christmas. Thank you guys so much for watching. Do you like this project? Let me know in the comments below. Do you like the card that I chose? I think it's pretty super cute. Do you follow also? Maybe I should ask the house that Lars built. If not, you guys should check her out because she does all kinds of really, really, really cool projects that I'm like in awe of. She's like a real crafty kind of a chick. And of course, Hallmark Signature, you can find those cards anywhere Hallmark cards are sold in the card aisle. And you can also check out the link below because it will tell you everywhere you can go near you to find them. So let me know what you guys think and I will see you next time. Bye.